Hey guys, Justin with Ready Business Systems. Today I'm going to be going over IFTTT, which stands for If This Then That. Uh, this is a very powerful automation tool. Uh, what it does is it syncs your services uh, uh, across the internet and makes them all work together. Uh, very, very powerful stuff. So depending on what services you use, um, here are the ones I have linked up. Uh, it will, it, it depends on you know, which services you've linked up, you get them, it depends on how powerful the system is and how you have them linked together. So for example, I have a personal Facebook linked up to, I have a, a Facebook pages. So what you do is you're gonna log into these individual services with your login credentials into IFTTT. And then you can set up rules to link these together. So uh, once you log in, uh, we have, I have Google Assistant, Google Sheets, notifications, I have Trello, WordPress, and YouTube. Uh, so inside my account, if you go to the, um, excuse me, if you go to my applets right here, these are the things you can search in the store and download. <clears throat> so these all these rules set up. So I'm gonna show you what I have set up. And I know there's a ton more that you can do with this. Um, again, some of it's a little frustrating. It's all user generated content. Uh, some of them don't work well, but the ones that do work awesome. And it, it takes a little bit of time to set it up. Once it's set up, it's automation. It just keeps working and it's awesome. So what I have here is um, I have both, uh, for any business systems, I have a personal Facebook page and I have a business Facebook page. Uh, what this applet will do is uh, when I post something on my personal Facebook page, um, it'll, sorry, Facebook status, it'll post it on my, my business Facebook page. So this saves a little bit of time every single time I do it. This applet here, um, my office manager, she fills out a weekly audit sheet on, on, on Google Sheets uh, which, which then I don't know when she updates that. So what I did is I set, if a cell gets updated in this sheet, then I get a notification on the app. So this is an app on your phone as well. I have TTT download that. Um, it'll send a notification to my phone when she updates the spreadsheet. Another thing, uh, when we, I have, um, a search engine optimization company, uh, that does my SEO for my companies and they, part of that is they write a blog. And in order to recycle this content, when they write a blog, it automatically posts it on my Facebook page. Uh, so it automatically shares it for me. So I'm recycling that content. I don't have to think about it. Another thing, I have a YouTube channel, obviously, because you're watching it. Uh, so when I, uh, when videos, when I post a video on my YouTube channel, uh, and then post it to Facebook. So all this stuff, uh, as you can see across, across the internet, um, I found myself doing a lot of copying and pasting, post on YouTube, share on Facebook. You want to make sure you're generating as much as you can, as much traffic as you can to your channel, to your website. And this automates a lot of this stuff for you. Another thing is, I don't know if you guys use Trello at all. Uh, Trello in itself is an automated task manager. Um, I'll get into that in a different video. <clears throat> but uh, what this does is if you use Google Assistant, which I have one in each room in my house. So, um, you know, turn on the lights, you know, remind me to do this. Um, I use Trello for my task management and uh, for things I need to remember. So I can just spit out at any time. I can say, I don't want to do it because actually I have a Google Home right next to me, but I'll say, um, you know what, I'll just do it because I have to explain it anyway and you can hear how it works. So, hey Google, add tasks, remind me to create YouTube video on Trello. Created a task card, remind me to create YouTube video on Trello to your Trello board. So as you can see, uh, Google Assistant just helped me out. I have my Google Assistant account hooked up. I also have my Trello account hooked up. So just by saying that when I'm in my room, when I'm in my car, I have Google Assistant everywhere, it's gonna add a task to my Trello board, which then reminds me to do things. Um, so that's what this is about. So super powerful stuff. Um, I always preach in terms of um, maximizing your time and efficiency. Uh, the first thing you wanna do is automate whatever you can possible because um, Another step is uh, outsourcing, so getting someone else to do tasks. So if you get someone to do a task, you want to make sure that it's efficient before you get them to do it because it's going to cost you more. You want them to work efficiently. So first, you optimize and automate anything you possibly can within your business, your personal life. Uh, once you do that, you then outsource it. So I, I, could I have someone else uh, copy and paste my YouTube videos to my Facebook page? Absolutely. Um, but that's not efficient. I'd rather optimize it. Uh, or example, the blog as well. Could I have someone uh, copy and paste my blog uh, to my Facebook channel? Absolutely. Uh, instead, could I have it automated that my blog is written by a computer? Probably not. So I have someone write my blog, 
which then is then automated to post my Facebook page. So whatever you can possibly automate first, automate it, make your processes efficient, uh, and then you can then delegate it, outsource to get it done. Uh, any other questions, uh, check out the website, readybusinesssystems.com. Uh, we also have a blog, a YouTube channel. I'll catch you guys next time.